Hello, Alley Nation. What's up? How's everybody doing today? Howdy. What's up? Yes, you have to wait 15 whole minutes to actually see us. Try to. 15 minutes is an eternity. Yeah, but we're worth it, right? Allie's yeah. worth it. I'm not. <laughs> I bet they're all here for you. <laughs> Hola, Puerto Rico. Hola. And hello from Missouri. Hello, Missouri. And hello, Seattle. Hello, Missouri. How's it going over there? Hello. Hello, Brazil. And Washington. Tacoma. Nice place. Yeah, I'm quite tired, too. We've been very busy. <laughs> Allie is a busy princess. Busy, hey, busy princess. Callie in the house. Welcome. Oh, Alice, whoop, whoop. Whoop, whoop. What Texas. time is it where you guys All are? Right. Always up to no good down there. <laughs> Old Cuss Island. Where's that? I don't know. It sounds pretty cool, though. Yeah, we, we haven't had rain for a while, but I'm not really particularly in need of it. <laughs> Yeah, the castle gets kind of damp when it rains. So yeah. I don't look forward to that. Somebody has Would to be nice the boat. Though, you know. Yeah. I just can't wait for the weather to cool down so we get that a nice snowy castle. Right. That's what I look forward That'd to. That'd be nice, right? A wet castle? Not White fun. castle in time for Christmas. A snowy castle, though. Oh, hola, Colombia. Oh, Colombia. All right. Montana. Hey, big sky country. It's quite late where you guys are. Argentina, all right. Georgia, welcome. <laughs> Thank you. I'm glad you're excited for this episode. We're going to have uh, one more final one. Yeah, this is part review. two. Yeah. There will be a part, part three two. as well on Halloween. Nice to meet you. How do you say your name? S. Junior? Emily, Senior Junior? thank you for joining us, even though it's mad late where you are. <laughs> or early. Well, Depending on how you look at early. it. Okay, yeah. Depending on how you look, like glass yeah. half full, glass half empty. Yeah. <laughs> <You know? laughs> Hi, Buenos Aires. Emma, thank you for joining us. Argentina. Oh, Alabama. wow. Joining us from Ukraine. Well, thank you. Ukraine. Wow. <laughs> That's their occasion. Yeah, yeah. So pleased to see all of you guys from. So many different places. Isn't there, wasn't there a movie called White Castle? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a, way, got way these back. great little hamburgers. It's an American thing. Is it? Yeah. Am I revealing my okay. <laughs> No, they're still, they're still around. Oh, yeah. that's cool. South Africa. Hello. And France. Bonjour. We have a very international audience today. Yes. It feels like more international than normal. I'm not sure what's going on here. Maybe because we're, we're chatting with them. Um, oh, yeah, yeah. There you go. Sherry, come on. Would you rather be here or would you rather be playing chess? What I mean, chess Come match? on. Is there like an international? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Hello, Sweden. Yeah, the live stream is today, not tomorrow. <laughs> Does it say tomorrow? Did we announce it wrong? All right. Maybe well, it's tomorrow have a good somewhere. Night, SJR. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah. Good night. If you could wait like ten more minutes, you'll get a gift code. <laughs> and you'll get to see. <laughs> <laughs> and you'll actually get to see our faces. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. We're not exactly, surprised, Maria. Ma Maria. <laughs> oh, she Julian's from Mars. We've got someone from, oh, we've got a Martian. Hello, bunny. Could we, bunny. It's a, it's a cool name. Yeah, I think so too. Canada, Ohio. Ohio. Okay. We're like on different timelines. So. Howdy, Texas. All right, Mexico, quite a, quite a few Texas. Arizona, man. From 
all over today. <laughs> Welcome in the new day. Some of them. So, who's going to give us some theories on who they think did it? Yeah, who do you guys think did it? Or is there is there only one suspect? Have we made it very Or are there more than one murderer? Or is it like totally clear who's who, who <laughs> did it? Who done it? Dakota, Jamaica, lots of different places. Hey, welcome Cecilia, Callie in the house. Wisconsin. Wisconsin's cool. They got oh, good cheese, good food all around. <laughs> That's nice. Like epic cheese. Hello, Miss M. Someone's from Kentucky. Kentucky's cool. Yeah. Is that where all the fried chicken? <laughs> I bet you get that all the time. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Blue uh, Toast thinks it's Kerwin. Yeah, we think it's Kerwin, too. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Chaos, he figured it out. He's it very was definitely sus. us. Very sus. Yeah. It was definitely yeah. us. It's definitely us. I see you. <laughs> Mississippi. Oh, hi from New Zealand. Shout out to all the Kiwis. Do, do they really call themselves that? Yeah, we call them. Okay, okay. Because the kiwi bird? Exactly, Sherry. It was definitely Kerwin. Yeah, lots of people suspect Kerwin. Anything bad that happens in the kingdom, it's always Kerwin. <laughs> it sounds like he's always a cool guy. Either way, I mean, you're, you're just, you're pretty safe blaming Ker Kerwin. Hello. Lance looks shady. Yeah, you're right, Robert. Lance does look kind of shady. Hey now. Is it is it my monocle? What is it? Michigander. Is that how you say someone from Michigan? Michigander. It is. First time it is. I've learned something every day. Oregon. Is it Oregon or Oregon? Oregon. Oregon. Exactly, Sherry. Half again. He is definitely the bad guy. Why is it just a black screen? Is there something wrong about screen? Mm -hmm. Oh dear. Really? Yes, yes, it was us. It was us. Ali for sure. <laughs> Ali and Lance. As usual, Ali did it, and then I had to help clean up. Oh come on, Lance. <laughs> That's why I keep you around for. Hey, you know what they say? A friend will help you move, but a best friend will yeah. help you move a body. <laughs> exactly. Oh, man. Hey, Lunch just said I'm his best friend, guy. How about that? Abe's or Kerwin? Oregon. <laughs> Taffy, we're just having a little chat before we get started, so, you know. Feel free to, you know, leave a message. Or tell us who you suspect. Who you suspect. <laughs> All right, wicked fun, Massachusetts. I'm not even gonna try, gonna try to do. attempt a Boston accent. Like, that's not gonna yeah, we like that Lance. This voice is not like a robot this time too. Thank you, Diane. Thank you. Hey Lance, do you have blood <laughs> on your monocle? We've been working hard to get that fixed. Robert wants to know if you got blood on your monocle. I washed it off. <laughs> Was that a confession? Yeah, kind of. Oh, God. I did Gosh, it again. Darn it. Lance, is this your first time? It's my first time committing a crime. You know, like, I'm going to get some things wrong. <laughs> <coughs> like, don't talk about the fact I did the crime. Yeah, Lance is a first time. <laughs> let's just let's just cut him some Tunisia, flag. no, we're not on Twitch. Although, you know, Hi, who knows okay? what the future holds. We may, we may end up on there eventually. And, we'll see. Yeah. We're doing Louisiana. pretty good, Julia. How are you doing? How are you all doing? Louisiana in the house. Louisiana, Arizona. Right. Alicia, yo. <laughs> That's my favorite comment right there. <laughs> Chilly and cool. Yeah, how's the weather where you guys are? It's it's gotten a little bit colder in the castle <laughs> after the after the medieval lockdown. 
Yo, Robbie and Natalie, Callie in the house. Callie in the house. There's a new Lance in the clothing shop. You got some new clothes? Hey, Wyoming, all right. Can we get all 56? I think, today? I, I'd say we're about at least halfway there. <laughs> Rhode, Rhode Island? Island? All right. That's Tanzania. nice, Greg. Cool. That's good. You should always keep nice and warm. Yeah, well, Wisconsin's always pretty cold, right? Hmm. Does it snow there? Oh, yeah, they get big snow. Big snow? Big snow. I'm looking forward to the snow this year. Greece, awesome. Yeah, there was someone from Athens as well. Was there? Yeah. Oh. Virginia? Okay. Very international. North Carolina? Man, we are almost there. <laughs> we got, we've got yeah, about like, like Melbourne. 25, 30 Australians. 50 right now. <laughs> Maryland, New York, Arkansas. Wow. wow we are almost Everybody there. representing today. Tennessee? Man. So nice to say Arkansas. <laughs> oh. Kansas? Sweden, awesome. Welcome. Delaware, Ontario. okay. Wow. That's amazing. Minnesota, Delaware. cool. Germany? Wow. <laughs> That's so cool. Is there actually a place called Kawawa? There is. Oh. There is indeed. Yeah, see, Wisconsin, they get big snow. Guys, if you're <laughs> seeing a black screen, just try and refresh and see if that helps. Because I saw some people mention that they can't see anything and they only have a black screen. 300 inches in winter. What's that in, uh, <laughs> you know, normal people's snow? Oh, oh. <laughs> Allie. It's big snow. I'll just put it all there. All right. Big Mexico. snow. All right. Yeah, we are getting close to all 50 states. Yeah, you might never see Allie again. I've, I've been trying to take over the show and push Allie out, but haven't succeeded yet. You wish, Lance. The Lance Show. We'll see who's the last man standing. <laughs> uh. Guys, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, make sure you subscribe and share with all your friends. And they can also get our giveaways today. That's right. That's yeah. right. Also, make sure you ring Ali's <laughs> bell so that you get notifications yes. for all of our upcoming videos. Ring my bell, ring my bell. Ring a ding ding. Chicago. Chai Town, yeah. What's Chai Town, Chicago? Yeah. Oh, okay. You know, Lance got that street cred. <laughs> yeah, you do. I'm very street. <laughs> All you're missing is like a gold <laughs> chain or something. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, very early in the UK. Yeah, we're, we're going to you live from the dungeon. Oh, we were going to, but it was a little dark down there. Guys, you're about to see us soon. Are you excited? We need, we need a proper lighting, especially Allie, because she's such a diva. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I need like three people to hold light. I would never push Allie off a balcony, but I would take over her show. Would you? Would I you would. now? You I can would. try. Definitely. You can try. Wait, am I, am I saying things out loud I shouldn't again? <laughs> you definitely shouldn't be <laughs> making all those confessions. Hi guys! Hello! Welcome, welcome back! Hey, you finally got to see us. Did anybody wait long enough to see us in person? That's right! Hi everyone! Thanks for waiting around and chatting with us. Yeah, so fun to chat with you guys beforehand. I think it we was. should make this like a staple. That's yeah. right, that's right. Alright guys, how have you been? It's been 36 days since we last saw you. I've been counting. It's been quite a long time. It yeah, has. it's yeah. been quite a while. I've almost forgotten. What, what were we doing 36 days ago? Uh, there well, was some sort of like something going it's on. It's all gone blind and blur. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Something happened. I don't I don't quite remember. We were investigating a case, remember? By order of the Lord. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that's right. There was somebody hiding in a closet. And yes. Is it coming a, back to you now? A body on the floor there was or something. A body. Yeah, yeah, there was it's, lots of blood. It's, it's very vague since yeah. it was so long ago. Yeah. Lance is very busy. Yes. I, I am, I am. Lots of castle have, matters to attend. I have lots of lords to serve, and they always have... <laughs> Who, which other lords did you serve? 
I, I serve lords all over the oh room. Oh my gosh, you play. My services are in demand. Very oh, high I, demand. Yeah, I bet they are. Always running around the kingdom. That's right. <laughs> Guys, you better line up for Lance's service because he's <laughs> very high in demand. There's a waiting list. Come There's on. There's a waiting list, is there? But hey, we're here to solve a murder. So we're here to solve a murder. I told those lords to wait mm -hmm. so we can figure out who done it. Oh, yes. We're trying to figure out uh, who killed the villager Andrew mm -hmm. and also mm -hmm. uh, who killed El Cid. That's right. That's yes. Right. But before Poor that, we have some news for you because we have our Halloween update coming up. Ah, that's right. Yeah, that's did right. you guys know about that? Who here knows about the Halloween update? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We have lots of Halloween events and mm -hmm. there's also a pet race that's a ranking event. Ah, okay. Yeah. So you make sure that you guys uh, fight for the top of the ranks. Get to the top of the ranking mm -hmm. so that you get we'll be a big old pile for you. of rewards. Yeah, big, like this big. Like, this big. like that? Yeah. Like this big. Okay, that's pretty uh -huh. big. And also, if you're new to our stream, uh, make sure you subscribe so you can always find us. And also, like and we always have a regular gift code. That's right. Up here. Make sure to claim it. Yep. Make sure you claim that. And um, uh, if you're not sure how to claim it, uh, we've got our handy assistant in the comments um, that will show you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. And if you're not new, also remember to claim our gift code because we have lots of giveaways for you today. That's right. We have a lot. Mm-hmm. All right, guys, are you ready to see our new event? We have one of our producers who will be introducing I'm excited to, to check it out. Mm -hmm. like, I, I don't know what's going on. Yeah, I'm actually, I mean, I've heard some things, but I haven't actually seen it. So let's take a look yeah. at our Halloween events. Da -da -da, in three, two, one, let's go. Hey, Lord of the King's Choice, it's me again. Long time no see. Today, I want to introduce to you our latest Halloween update, which brings a brand new series of events. The Halloween event, Trick or Treat, and the ranking event, Pet Race. Let's get into it! In the ranking event, Pet Race, your pets can compete with other players' pets. During the race, you can combine skills in many different ways to win. What's more? Random factors such as weather add an element of surprise to the race results, making each match a unique experience. Before participating in the pet race, select a pet join to race. Lords who don't own a pet must adopt one first. Lords can select up to 5 skills for the race. Only the skills selected take effect during the race. Lords can adjust their skills before each race. Lords earn race participating changes after a certain time. Use these chances to join the race. During the race, lords will encounter other lords with a chance to meet heroes and lovers. The weather is different during each race, affecting the type and quantity of obstacles on the racetrack. We have the race preparation page for more details. Racetrack obstacles include spikes, puddles, sand piles, and supply stations, which will all affect pets during the race. The race track is also affected by special skills brought to the race by other lords, so be prepared for anything. After participating in a set number of races, lords will earn skill study chance. During each study session, lords may choose to study one of the three available skills. After earning a skill, the already possess Lords can promote that skill, increasing its effects. After drawing the set number of rewards, Lords are guaranteed to earn a golden skill. The Pet Race ranking event will be regularly available in the future. During the event, Lords can compete for higher ranks to win greater rewards. So stay tuned and don't miss out! Next, let's talk about the Halloween event Trick or Treat. The gingerbread house in the event comes in various styles, all with a strong festive atmosphere. The prize draw is easier to play this time. You can draw various random events, such as massive candy rewards, pranking on other players or the candy ghost. If you get pranked, you can invite Alliance member to help you get rid of debuffs. Join in for fun 
interaction and help each other out. The gingerbread house will regularly produce candy, which must be collected manually. During the event, you will receive a certain number of pumpkins every day, which can be used to draw candy on the pumpkin machine. Your chances to draw will be restored over time and will stop after reaching the limit. When you draw a candy or candy bag, you are guaranteed to get candy. This event is triggered when you draw three identical trick star bats. You can launch a prank attack on random players and their building will be harassed by the bats. This event is triggered when you draw three identical candy ghosts. You can take candy from the candy master's house on the pumpkin machine. When you draw three of the same pumpkin, you will recover prize draw chances. You can get up to three pumpkin scarecrows when you have been pranked. One scarecrow will be consumed to block the attack. All right, there are also so many other improvements within this update. Due to the limited time, I won't go into detail today. Lords can pay attention to our new update coming soon. That's it for today, Lords of the King's Choice. I hope you enjoyed this video today. And let us know what you think about this update in the comments. See you next time. Bye-bye. Wow, thank, thank you, you so much the for producer X for that. Bye-bye. <laughs> that was very informative. Yes, that was really helpful. Mm -hmm. I hope uh, you guys, um, after watching that video, you'll have a better chance at um, getting to the top of the ranks. Yeah, Use and that a info idea. wisely and get to the top of the rankings. Exactly. Good luck, guys. Good luck. All right. Well, our main job today is actually uh, to further investigate our murder case. That That's right. Yeah. Back to the mystery. Mm, back to the mystery because uh, although we found a lot of clues last time, we still can't quite get to the truth. No, right now. we don't know who done it yet. No. Though we have our We're suspicions, sure. it's Kerwin. Yes. <laughs> yeah, stop doing that. <laughs> <laughs> Am I turning everybody against Kerwin? Yeah, you're turning everyone against Kerwin. Well, I mean, some people already suspected him, so I guess. I think most people already don't like Kerwin. So what's the harm? <laughs> he is know? kind of sus, even if I do say so myself. Yeah, he's pretty sus. Yeah. Right, so uh, if you guys remember, we examined um, Andrew's crime scene last time. We did. And uh, we also found Dinah hiding in the closet. That's right. Actually, her. it was Dinah's room. Yes, it was her room. Andrew was dead inside the room. Yeah, yeah. so I guess she was hiding from the murderer. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's what you do. That's what you do, exactly. Don't, don't try to um, fight the murderer. You should probably just hide. Yeah. yeah, that's the smart thing. Yeah, and close console. Um, yes. And then Dinah told us um, that she saw the poison uh, in Jacques. That's right. That's so right. I guess so Jacques, now Jacques is, is suspect now too. too huh? Yeah. Okay. And you know we want to prove that El Cid was innocent, but then we found out that he actually died in prison. So yeah, yeah we're just we're not sure what's I'm going on right now, and um, later we'll have to go to the prison check out his crime. Indeed. Yeah, yeah. and see if, what clues he's left for us. Mm -hmm. All right, so uh, let's take a look at what happened previously in the last episode. In three, two, one. The villager Andrew was found tragically dead in the doctor's house. But the one who came to term themselves him was actually... Elian Lance visited the crime scene to investigate and collect clues. The three wounds on the victim, Andrew, which one killed him? Elsie's sword that's covered in blood. Is it really the weapon that killed Andrew? Andrew's letter slandering Diane. Was it the trigger that led him to his death? The letter from Elsie, lovely kept by Diana in the safe. Elsie's ring bound on the floor. They seem to reveal a hidden romance between the two. But how does this relate to Elsie's admission of murder? Andrew is on this list of patients. 
So can Jackis be ruled out as a suspect? Why was Andrew carrying Corinne's family coin on his person? Was he working for Kerwin? The clues found in this case so far are still confusing and don't seem to reveal the true killer. Ellie and Lance decide to return to the scene to find new evidence. Diana unexpectedly appeared and a retelling of the series of events before Andrew's death left the fog on the case. To be continued in the next episode, Let's continue to look for the answer together. All right, now uh, back to our clue board. Um, firstly, our victim, uh, El Cid. El Cid. Yeah. Okay. Let's take a look at what we got for El Cid. Yeah. Well. <sighs> Poor guy. Yeah, sadly he's dead, and yeah. we have to find out um, who killed him and why. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. To name right. So, guys. Um. Uh, so. So you guys know we have lots of uh, Easter eggs coming up in this episode, so you better uh, keep your eyes peeled and pay attention because uh, you don't know, even we don't know where you're going to find them. Yeah, yeah, it could be anywhere. It could be anywhere. At any time. Yes. So if there's anything that looks suspicious to you, uh, tell us in the comments and we'll take a look. Alright, without further ado, let's go to the prison to check out uh, Elsa's crime scene before we miss out anything. Well, we gotta we gotta investigate that crime scene because yeah, there's gotta, gotta be some clues there. We gotta investigate more thoroughly than last time because you know last time I feel like we missed out. We quite a bit. almost left Diana in the closet. Well, yeah, exactly. Without uh, the audience's help, we almost left her there. I know. Yeah. I can't believe we overlooked that. <laughs> okay, on our way. By order of Lord Kerwin, no one may approach Navil Prison. What? My brother's orders? We are here by order of the Lord to investigate El Cid's case. Step aside at once. My orders are from Lord Kerwin, and they were very clear. No one in or out. I'm a princess of Nevil, and Lord Kerwin's sister. I was appointed by the Lord to investigate this case. If you dare place one finger on me, you answer to both your Lord Kerwin and the Lord himself. I hear the dungeons stay quite cool in the summertime. You may even enjoy it. Lance, there's definitely something sinister afoot. What do you think we should do? I think we got two options here. First off, like a superhero, I could kick the door in. I know everybody would enjoy seeing that. I'd enjoy doing it. The other option is, there's got to be a secret passageway around here somewhere, right? Oh, that reminds me. I saw one on the floor plan. Let's take the secret passage. Why don't we ask the audience what they'd like to see? Lance use his big, strong muscles and kick open the door like a superhero? Or use Allie's big brain? Tell us what you want, please. Tell us what you want, guys. So let's take the secret passage right. How's that sound? Yeah. Let's go, quietly. I always knew you had the brains to go with those dazzling good looks. Oh my goodness. El Cid, how, how did he come to be like, like this? Okay, let's take a look All at right. what we got here. What do you think we should check out first, man? I think, um, we, we should probably check examine out. the body yeah. first, right? Yeah, make sure nobody's tampering with Okay, uh, disclaimer here, this is a little graphic. Yeah, so you might want to avert your eyes. <laughs> this I is mean, a very... Solemn occasion. I shouldn't be laughing. This is very no. solemn. No. Yeah, it was very sad. Then. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Okay. El Cid. Buddy. All right. So, we looks like we have a couple of wounds here. Can we take a closer look at the wound? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take a look at this. So, let's start with this big knife right in the middle of his chest. Yes. Now, I'm not sure if this is fatal or not. Uh, no, I, I don't, don't know, know if we can you know? tell right now. Yeah. Let's have a look. Yeah, yeah. exactly, Let's Siri. See if there's I think somebody to... murdered him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty sure someone murdered him. <laughs> uh, murder most foul. Indeed. Okay, so. Oh, it looks like someone has found the Easter egg. So it, this looks a lot like a, jo a dagger that belonged to, to Jacques. Yes, it, I think it has his name written on it. Even. Let me take a closer look. 
Is his name written on it? On the handle somewhere? Hmm. Does it yes. say property Very of Jacques? Very small letters. It says property of Jacques. Please return to Jacques if found. It even has his address on it. Oh. Which is handy because we're probably need to check out his house later on as well. Okay. Since he's All such right. a primary suspect now. Definitely. He's definitely a primary suspect yeah. now. Okay. All right. Let's take a look at the next wound then. Hmm. We have bite marks on the what neck. Oh. Interesting. I now, mean, do you think those came from Diana? Oh, we can't rule that out. That's true. Because we did find out that they were having an underground romance, right? They were having something of, a, of an affair. Hmm. You know, a little summer fling. Yeah. But, I mean, they look a little bit like animal bite marks to me, though. Yeah, they do look a little savage. Hmm. Who would drain him of blood? Who would bite, bite him and drain him of blood? That's yeah. weird, right? Yeah. I mean, I can understand, like, Diana taking a bite, but she wouldn't, like, drain him of blood, oh right? Oh, gosh, no. That, that would be weird. very ghastly. What's the last wound, Lance? Let's okay, look. let's look at the last wound then. That would be a surprise if Diana killed him. Well, that, right? he's drained of blood, obviously. Huh. Okay. Oh, dear. You know, people in chat seem to think Diana might have killed him. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Like, that would be a big surprise if that happened. It would be. Yeah, that would to be. find that out in the end, because I would never suspect Diana. Diana was last on the list of suspects. Although, I mean, we always say we can't rule out anyone. That's true. Right? That's true. Although, well, this knife in the chest with Jacques' name on it, very suspect. Very suspect. But I wonder which of these wounds was the fatal wound that killed him. Do you think it was the bite mark? Well, I mean, bite mark. Or do you usually, think it was the knife in the chest? Usually aren't that fatal, but since he's drained of blood, I mean, it could be. That's true. But who would do that and... For what reason, right? Well, all right, so... It almost feel blood, like... That's it, not it a was a wound, right? Vampire. So tell us in the comments, what do you think? Do you think he was killed by this bite mark, or do you think he was killed by the dagger in the chest? Yeah, and also, speaking of the daggers, so it's Jacques' dagger. It is. And it we is. already know that Andrew was killed by Jacques. Well, highly suspected that that's true. he killed him. That's true. Mm-hmm. This and then now problem. it almost seems like he's one of the primary suspects for uh, Ilsid's death as well. Mm, that's true. And do you remember in the last episode, Ilsid actually mentioned to the Lord that he wanted to see Kerwin before he died, before we received news of his mm. death. So, you know, it's all connected because Jack works for Kerwin. I wonder what Kerwin has to do with this. It's all connected. Yes. Okay. And why would Kerwin do that? Uh, well, with Kerwin, I don't think you need to ask why. You just need to go, Kerwin did it, and everyone <laughs> just understands why. Well, yes, I think the comments agree with you on that, yeah. Yeah. Okay, mm. all right, well, let's take a look around at the rest of this uh, prison scene. Yes. And see what else we can find. Yes, we don't want to miss out on any clues. Okay, mm. so, you know, you know what's weird to me is, mm. is that there's a bed over here. And yet, he's laying on the floor hey, on something right. else over here. Yeah, I wonder why. So what is this? What, what is, is this that thing? under him? Yeah, what is this underneath him? A stretcher that transports the body. Why would he be laying on a stretcher? Do you think he was transported here after he died? So somebody, he was killed somewhere else and yeah, brought here? Yeah, this isn't the first crime scene. That's so weird. Then where did he mm. die? I don't know. That's what maybe, we have maybe, to find out. Maybe Kerwin's house? Mm. Well, <laughs> it seems like just like last time, the more clues we find, the more questions. I know. On Earth as well. We came here for some answers, for some yeah. clarity, and yet we're leaving with just more questions. Mm. Every time. Oh, look. Adrad says you stab vampires in the chest to kill them. Not exactly a wooden stake, was, but was that El is Cid an interesting vampire? possibility. Was El Cid a vampire? Hmm. Are we are we saying that vampires are a possibility now? I don't know. I've never seen a vampire. No. I but maybe that's the point. Maybe they don't want to be seen. That's true. I don't know. Okay, let's keep looking around and see what we can find. So let's have a look. there's a lot of things going on in this room. Yeah. Oh. Check out these numbers. Look, five. Wait, what do you think the numbers mean, guys? 
three. Do you guys oh, have an idea of what the numbers could mean? Is there any other numbers over? Oh yeah, there's a little one here. Uh, yeah. Clock. What are those things on the wall there? Are those These chains? Uh, yeah, is that torture equipment? Is they're, there, they're could there be any clues on there? And I assume those are for torture, but I'm not sure. And I wonder if El Cid left us any clues on the walls here. Oh, hey, look. Hey, I what's that? this hammer. Okay. Okay, so... Uh, try try bang on the wall, see if there's any hidden clues. Uh, no, nothing yet. Or, or hidden gift codes? <laughs> hidden gift codes no. is a possibility. It's a possibility. No, nothing so far. Oh. Oh, it's no. still just a clue. We already found clue. that clue. Okay. Nothing? Right. Oh, maybe the floor. Yeah, the floor. Maybe the floor will work? Huh. Oh, what's oh, that? hey, look at that. There was a secret box here. And it's glowing. And it's glowing. I bet it wants you to open it. Does it want me to open it? Does it want to be open? Does it want... I, oh, it doesn't oh, want to be open. it needs a code. Hmm, I wonder what the code could be. Chat, why don't you tell us in... Uh, why don't you tell Comment. us what you think the code is? is? Yeah. Hmm. I wonder what it could be. This is a very, very difficult question. It is, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, you know, the five is here is the biggest number. So that's probably first, right? But there's... How many numbers do we have right now? We three? Have three? There's numbers. a three over there, and there's a five there's a on the wall. Yeah, there's a five That's on the very wall. obvious. And then there was a seven, a little seven over oh, here. Oh, so seven is the biggest one we had so far. That's true. That's true. What order do you think we should put it? Chat seems to know seven, already three, because five. they're all saying five seven three. Okay. How about well, seven, you know, well, let's try seven five five three. seven three? Chat oh. always knows better than us. That's true. They helped us crack the code last time. They have. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Oh, hey, look at this. A letter. Another letter. What does this one say? Let what me take a look with my magnifying glass. Andrew, spread the word around the village that Doctor Dinah is a witch. <gasps> And you'll earn, oh my gosh, 10,000 pounds for your trouble. As long as she's blamed for the disappearances. The rumors? No rumor is too awful. So be creative. If necessary, mm. she can even disappear too. Undersigned Kerwin. Oh my gosh. I told you it was Kerwin. <laughs> this is such damning evidence against Kerwin. It's all... Every piece of evidence is damning evidence against Well, we, as, as they have said in the comments, even his name is kind of suspicious, so... <laughs> of course. Hmm. Well, it seems that Kerwin wrote a letter to Andrew, our first victim, instructing him to spread rumors about dying. Hmm. But well, that, that still doesn't cool. understand who sucked El Cid dry. Because <sighs> obviously, I mean, it could have been Kerwin, right? Could it, though? Did Kerwin suck him dry? Hmm. Mm. I don't know if we should phrase it like that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, very solemn. Okay, okay let's see yes. what else we got around here. We got numbers. Is there no chains. more clues on Elsa's body? Uh, I think no, we found no, them just all. Just the stab wounds. Mm, we don't want to miss out any clues. Let's click on the corners and stuff and see if we miss out any nook and cranny. Oh, hey, look what I found. Hey, I wonder what this All is. Right. Could it be another code for us to crack? It might be another gift code. Hmm. We'll see. What could this be? Okay. Well, enjoy that. Mm-hmm. Because, um... This one's only for a limited time. Yeah. That's right. And make sure you claim the, uh, the regular one that's always going to be in the corner there. Yes. Okay. All right, should we uh, head back and see what uh, what clues, uh, put all the clues together on our board? Yes, let's take a look at the clues. We better uh, summarize what we found so far. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, all right. for El Cid, we know that he's dead, number one. Number two, mm -hmm. he was stabbed, sucked dry, and no longer has any blood in him. Hmm. Yeah, there were three, well, I guess it's two wounds, but yes. Okay. Hmm. Next up, let's see, we Next have Kerwin, who, oh. who is our prime suspect. A number one suspect, because number there's one. a letter with his name on it, literally. Mm -hmm, uh -huh. mm -hmm. And 
who is uh, the second one here? And this would be our Jacques. other prime suspect, number, well, they're kind of 1A, number two? 1B. Uh, they're both number one suspects. Or are they tied, do you think? Um, this guy, he's got a lot of clues as well. Mm, well, you know, he has a dagger in uh, Elsa's chest. That one has That's his right. name on it, too. That's right. And also, remember last time, uh, there was a list of patients mm -hmm, mm -hmm. that uh, had his face on it? Well, someone That's put right. his face and, on it. And the, uh, the poison. Remember? Yes, that's true. Who, the poison. Who was it that saw him with the poison? Uh, Diana saw Diana him, with, saw the him with the poison. Yeah, in, that's the, right. in his bag. Mm. All right. Well, it seems that Jacques has three clues against him, while Kerwin so far only has one. Is it a competition for the, to see who gets the most clues? <laughs> well, I mean, they're connected, you see, because uh, Jacques is working with Kerwin. Mm. So it could be that Kerwin instructed Jacques to... Uh, do these murders mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and in that way I mean I guess Jacques would be an accomplice I guess what we yeah. have to do now would be is to uh, go check out their house see if we can find some real definitive proof yes. that it was one or the other right? you're right and, and since there's three clues against Jacques uh, I guess we should check out his house should we start with him? yeah we should start with him I think alright let's go let's go to Jacques' house now it's <clears throat> a nice carriage you got here no. Very, fancy. Fancy. Very fancy. Very fancy. Okay, so. All right. Take a look around, What Allie? do we think we should look at first? I mean, look at this place. It looks like someone's already searched it's through so it. So dusty. Yeah. Oh. What do you have over there? What do we have? Is that a map or something? What do we have on the desk here? Hmm. Try, and click, try and clicking on the, the desk and see if we. Oh. List of missing villagers. This is the same as last time. Oh wow, that is that what is, is it very doing sus. Here on very sus. Jack's desk. So, does he have something to do with the disappearing villagers? I would imagine probably so. Hmm. Why would he keep a list of missing persons? Yeah, that's very strange. And he's ticked it off as well. He's like, yo, I got this one, and I got this one, and, and I got that this one. one. And look, Andrew's underlined and circle. Is that yeah, because... Why would he star and circle Andrew's name? Yeah, what's so important about Andrew? That's odd. Because he was instructed to spread rumors? I don't know. This Did is... he die because he knew too much? Obviously, somebody knew too much. Obviously, someone knew too much. Is there anything else on this desk here? Try clicking on all the other stuff here. Okay. And let's see if we can we find more clues. And... Oh, what are these things up here? Oh, what are they? They're quite Why don't shiny. Let's take a look at those, Allie. Yeah. See what we got. Oh, colored gems. You do like gems. Yeah, I do like gems, but these, they're all, they're all different colors. I wonder what they're used for. Yeah, they have weird, different, right? different motifs on them. Hmm. That gold one, though, looks cool. Do we have to combine them? Or. To unlock some special power? Are these from a crime scene? Did he take these from a victim? Maybe, maybe he took them from Andrew? That's why he circled his name. He's like, I got your gems. Maybe. That's true. Let's have a look uh, around and see if we can find more clues. Okay. What else is there here? Just I a saw lot of dusty paper around work. here. Okay. Oh, there's a chest of drawers here. I wonder if there's any documents or oh, letters yeah, like yeah, last yeah. time. Okay. Take a look in there and see what you find, Ali. What is that? Is that a perfume collection? Oh, it's a bottle of poison. So after you administer for 30 minutes, the subject's heart rate will increase. And then blood pressure will also increase, causing them to bleed out from the eyes and ears. Doesn't that, that sound familiar? familiar? Mm -hmm. Did, who was bleeding out from the eyes and ears before? I think it was Andrew. Oh, yeah, That was one of right. his wounds. Yeah. Hmm. Well, I guess this pretty much says that Jacques killed him. So Jacques has a list of victims mm -hmm. and a drawer full of poison. Mm. A drawer full of poison. That's right. <laughs> like a whole. There were some collection. other bottles in there as well. All right, we'll see if there's any paperwork over there we can use. Mm. Mm. Why does it look like you're moonwalking, Allie? Yeah. Am I dancing? Okay. What's here? Oh. Oh, hey, look at that. Oh, lots of good stuff today. Yeah. Code. 
And it's covered in blood. All right. Well, well you guys better claim it quick. Claim yeah. this gift code before, before Someone the blood Someone might dries. have died for it, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> hmm. What else is there around here? There's lots of scrolls. What are these? What are all this stuff? Did he just move here? Yeah. It, it looks know. like he just moved in. It looks like he moved in, and didn't then didn't unpack, the and then never <laughs> came home. Has yeah. he just been living in the castle yeah. with you and like all of us? In the castle? Maybe Did he's he been living in home? some underground <laughs> secret passageway. Hmm. Plotting all this. Very What's that suspect. on the ground there? Let's take a look. Is that another picture? Oh dear. Oh dear. I seem to be moonwalking. You're always moonwalking. Oh, hey. What do you got there, Ali? Oh, what's that? There's magnifying glass. Click on it. There's oh. a note written by Jacques. She likes pumpkin pie. She likes champagne. Who doesn't? She likes gold. Yeah, you same like there. Well, I guess I like gold more than champagne. Hmm. And she likes bathing in sunlight. Bathing She'll never in enjoy any of this again. That sounds very ominous. Who is he writing about? I don't know. Hmm. hmm. I feel like we're not getting anywhere close to the truth. No, so it's just... I have a lot of questions. Clues so. after clues after clues. And then just more and more questions. Yeah. The mystery thickens. It always does. Yes. What else is there around here? Let's not miss out on any clues like last time. We better turn this place inside out. Let's go over there. Okay. All right. I think we should also look at the stuff on the ground as well. All right. Well, we got this weird picture here. Why does it have a hole in it, that painting? Wait. Whoa. Oh. You figured that out. Like, you That's knew what the what gems are used on, for. <laughs> Allie. Like, you knew what to do. Oh, I see. Hmm. Well, you know, it was just because I saw the word gold on the note. You just so I thought I might try it out. What to do. Yes. Okay. All right. Well, it looks like we got a picture of three people here. Kerwin and Jacques, obviously. But who's the girl? Hey, that's Elaine. That's Elaine? Yeah, that's Jacques' wife. Who's Elaine? Oh. oh, sorry. That's uh, Kerwin's wife. Looks like there's something on the back here. What does that say? I shall deliver you from illness. Huh. Even, Even if it means... In what? I don't know. That's odd. Deliver who? Oh, we have another picture here? Okay. Who is this? Is this, uh, so it's Elaine and this is what, Jacques also? That's so strange. What are they doing a photo together? Yeah. You know, uh, speaking of Elaine, I never saw her after the wedding. Wait, Which who did she get married kind to? Kind of strange now that I think about it. Who did she marry? Uh, she married Kerwin, my husband. Oh, brother. Elaine is Kerwin's wife? Yeah. Oh. Which is why is I think it's so strange. Yeah. Let's hmm. take a look. Is there other photos? That's odd. Let's see. Okay, now we got another picture of a threesome here. Oh. Could this be uh, the three of them as children? They do look pretty young. Hmm. hmm. Okay. So I guess they knew each other since they were very young. Yeah. I didn't know that. The threesome's back together again as they're older? Wow, it looks okay. like they're quite good friends because there's lots of photos of them together. They have a lot of photos together. Hmm. Okay. Oh, and that's then, their wedding photo. Oh, that's, that's their a wedding lovely photos. photo. Okay, all right. Man, she looks good. Yeah, I know. Yeah. She looks kind of pale, though, don't you think? Suspiciously pale? Suspiciously pale? Like she may need to drink blood? But then again, you know, I've been quite pale as well because I've been in the castle since the lockdown, so... That's just because you're rich, though. <laughs> Isn't she? I mean, she's practically... She is my uh, uh, half-sister-in-law, right? That's yeah. true. That's true. Okay, all right. More oh. wedding photos? More wedding photos. They look very happy. But you know what's strange? Why would Jack keep... Kerwin and Elaine's wedding photo. Yeah, wait. That's weird. Wait, yeah, this is Jacques' box. Yeah. Why would Jacques yeah. have pictures of Kerwin and Elaine's wedding? This all seems a little bit strange. This is very strange. Mm. More wedding photos? More this wedding so photos. Weird. And then there's just photos of him and Elaine. And more messages. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? My 
Dearest, I wish... I wish you eternal happiness. Interesting. Eternal. You know, the more the more clues I find, the more it seems like our vampire theory could be true. Hey, don't discount vampires. Wow. Right? Well, don't I you know so. the castle's haunted? Is, is it? Totally is. I've never heard that. Really? Where? Where oh, the castle is haunted? Armed Infidel has a good point. Vampires don't show up in photos. That's true, and they... They're probably scared of sunlight, unless your name is Edward. Were they married at night? <laughs> oh, that's true. Well, There's it so all many looks holes like they were married here. in the day. <laughs> okay. Well. Uh, they have a good point. Since we have like photos in medieval times, probably vampires are possible too. Is there anything else to find in here? Mm. Mm, do you want to click on uh, the other stuff? Maybe the lamps and that, that, that. Oh, what's something that hidden now? in the curtains. Can you wait? Can you hear? Can you hear something? What's that sound? Wait. Well, I well, heard. well. I see you share both your brother's wits and cunning. Shock! Lay down your weapon and stay where you are. <laughs> Relax. I was only giving Princess Ali my most sincere praise and appreciation. Jack, we have solid proof that you poisoned and killed Andrew. Also, the missing villagers. I'm certain you have something to do with them, too. <laughs> a village racked by the Black Death? If a few go missing here or there, who's to know or care? Selling the corpses for research, now that's worth a pretty penny. After all, that is what really makes this world go round, isn't it? Money. You, you heartless monster! Don't be so quick to judge me. I poisoned Andrew, but he was spreading heinous rumors all over town. Given what could have happened if the townspeople got riled up, I practically saved her life by taking his. What would we do without the good doctor? Jack, if you can still find a drop of conscience inside you, tell us why you killed El Cid with a dagger before his execution date and drained all the blood from his body. El Cid was drained of blood? <sighs> well, if you said I did it, then I guess I did it. Allie, stop asking me these tedious questions. You're so smart, I'm sure you'll figure it out one day. Jack, what are you hiding? We found a photo of you, Kerwin, and Elaine. You and Elaine? Be quiet. Enough of this meaningless speculation. I did it all. Me. This has nothing to do with her. Here is my confession. Oh, I almost forgot El Cid. Yeah, him too. I hope this was all worth it, Elaine. <gasps> no! Ali, this case still has so many unanswered questions. I agree. That wasn't a confession. He's definitely hiding a bigger secret. Jacques' confession didn't even mention El Cid's death when he showed us the first draft. I think he only found out about it just now. Also, what is the relationship between Jacques, Elaine, and Kerwin? Why did Jacques get so agitated when I mentioned Elaine? Lance, we must pay my brother a visit and unravel this mystery. You're right. I can't wait to find out what happens next. Let's go! Well, I can't believe you did that. Jacques's gone. That's, uh... You know, well... Wow. I, 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 I can't There's been a lot of deaths in this episode. I, I kind of... <laughs> I'm give very me a upset. Minute. Just very upset. I need, I need to just process this. Yeah, let's, let's take a moment to process this. And while we're taking this moment to process this, I wanted to uh, address some of the things I saw in chat just there a moment ago uh -huh. about how there's no pictures in medieval times. There's no photos. No photos in medieval times? Yes. I just have one word for all of you. Magic. <laughs> magic yes, we did pictures. use the magic book to transport last time, didn't we? Now, we have another mystery to solve. Another mystery. Why would Jacques jump out of a window? Yeah, who is he after trying confessing to... confessing to the murders? Protect. I feel like that's not the end of it. I can't believe it. Hmm. Well, you know, given the photos that we found, 
he definitely there's something going on between him and Elaine. Oh, there is something going on for yeah. sure. Yeah. Mm, I think Elaine is now quite suspicious as well. Yes. Yeah. Because we haven't seen her since. No. No. All right. Back All right. Now Kubo. we got two victims. Two more victims. Okay. So. Jot is also dead. All right, well, Jacques has a ton of clues now. He would be my prime suspect, except he jumped out of a window. Well, I mean, it doesn't rule out that he killed some of the victims, right, before he died. Okay, well, uh, so he was responsible for some of the victims, but not all of them? Yes, well, and let's go from the top. So Andrew was poisoned, and okay. the poison, uh, Dinah actually saw it in Jack's bag mm -hmm. and we found it in his house mm -hmm. so um, that's pretty much solid evidence that he killed Andrew mm -hmm. and on Ilse's body we also found a dagger with Jack's name on it mm -hmm. although we don't know whether Ilse was drained of blood first and then stabbed or the other way around mm. you know that also uh, throws some suspicion on Jack as well and in terms of Kerwin, uh, Andrew had his coin mm -hmm. on his body. You know, so. it, it feels like to me that Kerwin is kind of the one behind the scenes. Yeah, Maybe same. That's what I was getting to. Yes. I because, don't know. you know, with the letter that we found, there's definitely, uh, you know, some exchange between Kerwin and Andrew, and he instructed him to spread rumor. That's true. But. But we don't know why. So, you know, I find it very interesting that we started this with two primary suspects, Jacques and Kerwin. Uh-huh. Jacques's dead now. Jacques's dead now. After confessing to all kinds of crimes. And yet... All kinds of crimes that doesn't seem like he did. Well, you know, maybe he did a little and didn't do a little, you know. Yeah. A little bit of A, a little bit of B, but... What do you think? We're still ending with two suspects. Yes. Oh, Ellen, and Elaine. And now Elaine. Now there's the photos that connect to her. That's right. Well, you know, you know, from what Jacques said, it sounds like he only found out about Al Sid when we told him. Yeah, he didn't seem to know about that. No. Which is odd. Yeah, it's and very it, strange. It seemed like he was just um, taking the fall for it because he was planning to Jacques kill himself. Jacques was the fall guy, huh? Already. I that mean, makes sense. It, that, that just seems like he's trying to protect someone to me. Because, you know, Jacques, he, to me, feels like a guy that somebody would send to do something, not the guy that's, you know, given the order. Hmm. Is that what you think? You think someone instructed him as I well? I think there's, there's someone dark and <sighs> mysterious behind the scenes. Yes, it does seem like the there's strings. sinister forces behind mm. that we haven't found out yet. That's right. Uh, is there anything, any clue that we missed out, guys? Did we miss out anything this time? Someone, someone's asking. I saw someone asking if we can check the bodies again for gift codes. Uh, I don't think <laughs> they would hide gift codes on the bodies. That seems uh, a little bit too That's much. a little morbid. Yeah. I don't know. Hmm. And, you know, Elaine, I mean, we don't know that much about her yet. It's true. Yeah, it's true. so. I, guess I feel so like. We'll probably learn a lot more about Elaine in the next episode. Yes, because uh, I think for the next episode, we better check out Kerwin's house this time. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Because it's long overdue that we went to Kerwin's place and checked it out for clues. <laughs> yes, I think it's long overdue because, I mean, not just us, a lot of people think he's quite suspicious. That's right. And we have found some evidence that point to him. Literally everybody thinks he's suspicious. Literally. Well, basically, yeah. So I guess to get to the bottom of it, we have to go check out his place and see if there are any clues that okay. will either uh, prove that he's innocent mm -hmm. or, mm -hmm. you know, tell us the truth yep. about all of this. Yep. Now, yeah. I have a feeling, Ali, that you may be hiding something. What do you think I'm hiding? I think you may be hiding another gift code. Another gift code? What makes I'm, you think that? Just a guess. Where do you I think I could be sure. hiding it? Where hmm. would you be hiding it, Allie? Do you guys also think I'm hiding a gift code? Chat, or is Lance hiding, hiding a gift code? Because I'm pretty sure she's hiding a gift code. Let's 
Can you take off your hat? Is there a zip code under your hat? Hmm, it seems so. like it, it, you can't take it off. No, it won't come no, off. No, no. It's nailed on there. Is there or is there not another gift code, guys? Well, we'll find out very soon. In three, two, one. Ta -da! I knew you were hiding a gift code. No, Jake, I did not pick my nose. I'm a princess. I didn't do that. <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> we don't do that, okay? Oh, man. <laughs> oh. I was trained very well. We <laughs> Somebody was keeping thing. a close eye on Allie. Stop staring at me, Jake, okay? I know I'm very pretty today, as usual. You look good, Allie. Come on. Like, oh, you thanks, Lance. You don't look half bad yourself. Why, thank you. Why is your collar so long, though? Someone wants to know. Uh, like show wants to know. My, my tailors, they... Sometimes I tell them, hey, look, you know, I don't want to... You're creative. <laughs> you know, you're fashionable. I don't want to tell you what to do. Just... Give me something that looks good, and then they come back with this. And That's then what true. am I supposed to do? If you leave it up you to know? the designers, it kind of gets out of hand. Yes. Yeah, you know. I, yeah. What can you do? We love you too, Tess. Okay, Thank so you, lucky. Tess. All right, guys. There's two gift codes up there. Don't forget to claim them. And just so you know, this last one uh, is valid for one whole day. So. Um, yes, the, the D9N, right? Yes. That one? Yeah, that one is valid one all day. Yeah, as you can see with the countdown there. Yeah, mm -hmm. because, uh, you know, we know that some people, they, the time isn't good for them to watch our stream. Yeah, so, unfortunately. We, yeah. We see you, Europe. Don't worry. Uh, you still be able to claim that code. And also, um, there's some more in the comments mm -hmm. as well. That's so right. if you don't know how to claim them, um, we've got it pinned up there in the comments. Uh, there's the instructions there. And if you have any questions, um, feel free to ask us in the comments. Please, and leave a comment. We'll, yes, we go back we always and like to them see later. your comments. So uh, if you have anything to say, please leave a comment mm -hmm. and we will check it out, okay? We'll definitely check it out. And also, if you haven't liked or subscribed to our channel, you better do it now or I'll be very mad. You don't want to see Allie mad. No, you don't want to see me mad. She is frightening. Frightening. Yes. And also leave us lots of comments and share with all your friends because we would love to see more and more people. Well, share see Allie with the world. Exactly. So that more people love you. But you know, Lance, it was great to see so many people from different places today. Yeah, we I was really a happy. Very to see diverse that. audience. Yeah. Almost all fifty states. Almost all fifty. Countries states. across the world. Mm -hmm. This was a this was an awesomely, uh, yeah, honestly I, a great show. Hopefully next time we'll also uh, see you guys again, and it was really great to see you guys uh, representing it was. your countries or uh, your region. Is there anything any other questions you guys have for us? And also, uh, if you have uh, anyone you suspect, leave it in the comments. And we'll see in the final review on Halloween. That's we'll right. see if you're right. You guys can start making bets now. <laughs> place your bets for yes, who done it. Yes, place your bets. And I wonder who will be next because it seems like someone mm -hmm. dies every episode. Hey, we have a new suspect almost every episode. Except Kerwin. Yes. That guy has just been sus from the beginning. That's true. Even his name. I mean, I gotta agree with them on that. Kind That's of true. A suspicious That's name. True. Even the, yeah, even his name is sus. <laughs> well, we will see you. We'll see you on the next time. Yes. For Halloween. Remember on so Halloween. Don't miss out. Ring the bell so you get notified. Ring my bell so you get all the updates That's and all the right. news on our channel. All right. All right, guys. Thank you so much for thank watching today. Thank you for today. watching and thank you for joining us. Thank and you for have helping a us. Wonderful with the day. Yes. Night. Whatever's going on. <laughs> Have a great weekend. <laughs> Have a great weekend. And we'll see you again next time. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.